Hey guys, this is Matt Kids and on. This is just going to be a review on Mobile Me. Now I know this is very late, um, since Mobile Me's been out for a long time, but a uh, few people have been asking me if they should buy Mobile Me or what what with that. So um I'm just going to be showing you what exactly um Mobile Me is and what you can do with Mobile Me and why it's great. So first of all, when you sign up for Mobile Me, you can sign up for iDisk Space for anything like that. And then of course you can access your files from Mac, PC, or Linux from me.com. And then you can just log in with your username and your password. Just like that. And in you have access to a suite of web applications that Apple has made for you to access your your uh, mobile me account from the internet. This is of course the email. Um it's really great. Um it even has a compose Compose thing, and it's all HTML, JavaScript. I mean, this works on practically any browser, and you can just drag attachments in and it'll attach them. That I I I I think that's pretty cool. Um, I don't know about you, but I've never seen an HTML thing be that good. So that that's that. Um, it also has online contacts, and this is the contacts app application. We're going to gray out the um, the last names of all of these people in our contacts and their email addresses um but this is um this is everything so this is this is pretty cool um let's go on to calendar and here's our calendar right here and you can just add add things to your calendar that's pretty cool this is an online iCal basically um there's photos this is your photo gallery and you can upload photos is actually my wallpaper background that I use in some of my videos. Right here is iDisk. If you pay for iDisk, you get to store things on your MobileMe account. You can upload any file, not a folder. So that includes pages. Pages is actually a folder. So you'd have to zip up pages documents in order to upload them. And um, yeah, right here is is your account, and it'll want your password. So I'm not going to show that to you. Um, but let's just go back. So that 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 is the suite of web applications that they allow you to use and that's nice in my opinion. But that's the web apps. You can also synchronize it with your machine so that way iCal gets all your stuff. It synchronizes your keychains which means any iChat passwords would get saved or email passwords or website passwords would get saved. It saves mail accounts and mail passwords and mail settings. It can even back up your dashboard widgets. I don't have any dashboard widgets installed on this user, but it can back those up. You just have to go in and configure Mobile Me, and it would look like this. And I'll show you all that you can sync. In System Preferences and Leopard, you just select Mobile Me, and you type your username and your password. Okay, then you sign in. Okay, and then you can say sync. And this is what it'll sync. Bookmarks, calendars, contacts, dashboard widgets, dock items, that's cool. Keychains, mail accounts, mail rules, signatures, etc. Notes, that's notes on your iPhone and in, in the notes in, in dashboard and your system preferences. There's also iDisk, which um, you, you, you have the ability to upload files to iDisk and store files on iDisk. And you can just sync your... Um, I disk and back to my Mac not that important so this is mobile me and I'll just sign out but that's pretty cool um, and I'm just gonna demonstrate what I disk looks like on the Mac you can mount I disk by going up to go I disk my I disk other users I disk I'll just click that and type my username and password okay so here we go. Here's my iDisk. It mounts right to your desktop. And it's actually physically mounted. This is now physically mounted on your computer. So if you open up terminal, you can type CD space and then go to your iDisk and hit enter. And then you can type LS and you're actually in your iDisk terminal. Like this is this is a virtual hard drive connected to your computer virtually. Um, you can also have your public folder open to other people so that you can access it. That's cool sites this is for um what's it called basically iweb and so is web um documents for your documents obviously backup you can back up your stuff there 
groups. This is all just, just standard stuff, um, but it really looks like it's mounted, and of course you can access it through the internet from me.com. Um, and this is not just all it has to offer. From your iPhone, and I'll just bring up a picture of an iPhone, or iPod Touch, this search is the iPod Touch as well, I believe. You are able to um, sync your contact on your iPhone, as you could with your computer, with your mobile me. You can sync your Safari bookmarks as you can with mobile me. Um, you can sync uh, your photos, obviously, and your settings right there. And I, I think that's pretty cool that you can synchronize your iPhone, your computers, your mobile me account in general, your iDisc, everything just on online. And I it it's just pretty cool how this works. So mobile me in my opinion is 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 great and um it's just interesting how it works. So um basically that is a mobile me review. Um so just get a mobile me, maybe get a trial, I don't know. It's 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 cool and I especially love iDisc. I I think that's one of the well thought out things. So this is a good way to spend spend a hundred dollars a year or something like that. It's it's pretty cheap in um retrospect. It also gives you push email. So with your iPhone, instead of getting emails every fifteen minutes, your iPhone bings as soon as you have an email. Which is great. I tested it out with Mac Kids and One. I just started spamming someone so they got an email every five seconds and their iPhone was binging every five seconds because it's so accurate. So it's an advantage and if you get spammed a lot, it's a disadvantage. But it's it's pretty cool how um push email, push contacts, push calendar. It also syncs your calendar. I I forgot to mention that on your iPhone. Um but it's it's just cool. Um so you should try it out. Just get mobile me, get a trial. So um thank you for watching Mac Kids and One. Subscribe and goodbye.